Now, as we turn to our baptism moment, and we think of that price that Jesus paid, there is a response to that price. Jesus says, come to me if you want what I have to offer. Come to me. And baptism signifies people who have heard that message that there is rest available because Jesus took their place and now offers it to them. And they've said yes through faith, through repentance. That's what baptism signifies, that I'm turning on one life that looks for my rest and my joy and my delight outside of Jesus. I'm done with that life, and I'm trusting that Christ, what you've done for me is enough to forgive me and give me that rest that my soul longs for. So when you see people in the water, remember that they once lived a life of unrest and that Jesus took that unrest on the cross so that they with him could be resurrected out of the water just as he was resurrected out of the grave because by faith they are now joined to a resurrected Jesus. Amen? So this is our gospel message and this is our gospel moment. If you are to be baptized, would you come and uh, Mitch, would you gather them? This is Mitch over here and uh, I'm going to ask Daniel to come and um, we're going to Uh, play a song right now, and and the song's going to be about uh, seeing a victory. And and this is a victory that these people are proclaiming that that has happened because of their faith in Christ's finished work. And as we prepare to go into the tank and and make this public proclamation, I want to ask you guys a question. If I could have your attention just for a minute, because, because it's, it's important to publicly proclaim before we get to this moment. Do you guys all, do you guys all understand yourself to be sinners without any hope besides the hope of Christ crucified and resurrected? Is that a yes for you guys? And do you now devote yourself to coming to Jesus both in this moment and for the rest of your life? for the rest that only he can give. Is that a yes? All right. Let's do this, Avenue Church. Amen? In case you can't hear me, which you probably won't because we're going to sing over you and we're going to ask for you to remain seated for the first part while everyone's getting baptized so you can see. Uh, And the second part, uh, one of our leaders will ask you to stand and worship with us. But I will be baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, the only one who can do this work.
good to be here for this. What a, what a beautiful testimony of who Jesus is and what he did for us. Uh, so good, so good. Uh, just a couple quick announcements. I'm going to pray for all of us, especially for those who are just baptized. Don't forget, shape Sunday right after service. If you want to know how God has shaped you to serve him, come join us in the next building down the sidewalk over in the Avenue Church offices starting at noon. Everyone is welcome. Okay, everyone is welcome to be a part of that. Also, prayer partners, if you guys want to come and assemble on the sides, if you have prayer needs today, any prayer need whatsoever for yourself or for another, come see our prayer partners. They want to pray uh, with you and for you and uh, see what greater works God does um, in your life. All right, you guys ready to pray? Let's pray together. Father, thank you so much for this day. Father, thank you for the, the word and calling us to rest in you, our, our Savior, our Lord, our Sustainer, our friend, our everything. And Father, we thank you for the testimony we've seen uh, this morning and those who have been baptized, showing that they know you and love you and believe in you, Father. We pray that you'd bless them. Father, help them connect with individuals in their lives who can, who can help them to follow Jesus, help them connect uh, with groups that can do the same and, and with our church and beyond. Lord, bless them. Uh, touch them by your Holy Spirit. Give them that great, deep, abiding sense of adoption that they are your children, beloved, valued, cherished. Father, now bless us as we go. It's in Christ's name we pray. Amen. God bless you guys.